reason I keep coming back to these seminars and looking for these seminars is because they're so practical and so well put together and there's so much information that you get and free materials that you get, it's just hard to pass up. Oh cool, soybeans. Like when I came here at first I was like, you know, soybeans are well, I didn't know what soybeans really were, how they impacted everything else. And so I get really excited now when she said, Hey, we're going to do a soybean lab and I'm like, oh, yes, because it's so fun to experience the different things that it does. Like you can make chapstick, lotion, soap, anything. And I didn't realize that before I came here. It was fun because you got to tell these kids like everything you're using pretty much is made from this one plant, you know, and that you may see it everywhere, but it's a really good thing that you do because we can use it for so much. I mean, I love the Grow Next Gen website. I mean, the opportunity to educate people about what we do is, is just tremendous. I want an educated consumer, and it's necessary for us to go and let others know what we do and how we do it. To actually come and see it and talk to the farmers and know, you know, out of their own mouths, they were talking about how committed they were, not to just making a buck, but to make sure that they are growing um, nutritious and healthy food and at the same time being conscientious about the environment. Really the hit home piece of it was that those teachers are going to go back and take this information to the classroom and work directly with their students. I know those teachers have a lot of influence on the youth of our community and from a career standpoint. So they, they explored careers and I had the opportunity to interact with a lot of teachers on career path and just the expanded opportunities in the agriculture industry. I mean, just the fact that these are professions that my children can go into. You know, the biotechnology and, you know, it's just wide open. And so I'm really interested in going on the NextGen website and looking at some of the videos so I can show these to my students and say, these are some other careers that maybe we didn't think about and maybe you didn't know about that you can go into you know, that's connected to soybean and connected to agriculture. I thought before this it was just kind of like, just like farming and stuff like that. And I wanted to be like a scientist and like stuff. So like now that like all the experiments that I've gone through, I realize like them, there's like fields for like STEM and agriculture that I had no idea about. And that's like kind of opened my mind a lot more and had like a broader perspective on everything. Well, I played the cello and I wanted to be a musician or go into music of sorts. And then when I took Miss Faldry's food science class last year, I was like, this is really cool. Like I could I could do this. And so I loved when I went over there every day because it was the end of the day, you know, that's always exciting to start with. And then as I went in, I was like, I love the lectures, I love the everything else. So now I'm thinking about careering in food science.